everyone, it's Justin again. Welcome to the Place Value Galaxy. Today we're going to visit an amazing new planet that was just discovered called Numeria. It's a fascinating place with some amazing features that can help us learn about large numbers and place values. Are you ready to explore space with me? Let's go! By the end of today's lesson, you'll be able to describe the places and values of digits in numbers up to the millions. You'll also be able to identify patterns in place value names and know where to place commas in multi-digit numbers. Have your guided notes ready, and let's find our place in space. Wow, what an amazing view. But why is there smoke coming out of that mountain over there? Really? I've never seen an active volcano before. I wonder how many active volcanoes there are on Numeria. Mia's map here shows us how many incredible features of Numeria there are. Oh, wow, it even lists how many active volcanoes there are. Let's review the place values we're already familiar with to figure out what this number means. First, we have the ones place, and over here is the thousands place. What about the names of these two place values in between the ones and the thousands? After the ones place comes the tens place, then the hundreds place. That means that the amount of active volcanoes on Numeria is nine thousands, five hundreds, three tens, and two ones put together to make the number 9,532. We can use the place value of the digits in a number to determine what a number means, but numbers can get way bigger than this. Let's observe the number of crystal caves that are on this planet. Hey, this number has more than four digits, which must mean it goes beyond the thousands place. Huh, I wonder how we say this number in words then. Fortunately, our place value names continue beyond the thousands place, and they can help us read bigger numbers like these. You already know the ones, tens, hundreds, and thousands places. Next comes the ten thousands place and the hundred thousands place. What do you notice about the names of these place values? Pause here to record your thinking in your guide to notes. There's a pattern to the names of the place value system. The labels repeat themselves with each set of three digits. Here are the ones, tens, and hundreds places, and these are the thousands ten thousands, and hundred thousands places. So if we went to the next greater place values, it would be the millions place, followed by ten millions and hundred millions places. Do you notice anything else about multi-digit numbers? Do they include anything special, or are they broken up a certain way? The commas, yeah! Multi-digit numbers are separated by commas every three digits. The commas are a cue when reading numbers. We start with the leftmost digits. They read 120. The comma here, by the thousands place, tells us to say thousand. So we say 120,000. 428 crystal caves. I bet it would take years to explore them all. What do we do when there's more than one comma in a number, though? This comma, next to the millions place, tells us to give the label million. But how do we read the numbers between the commas? Oh, it's a three-digit number. 
That means the number of ancient ruins is 1,973,285. Pause here to practice reading the number of luminous plants and rainbow waterfalls on Numeria. You can practice saying the number aloud or writing it out with words. Only one comma means we'll need to use the label thousand when we get to it. There are 789,012 luminous plants on Numeria. The number of rainbow waterfalls on Numeria is read as 1,029,000. 493. Great work, space explorers! Now that we know how to read these larger numbers, let's explore more about what digits mean in their individual place values. When we look at the number of twinkling stars visible from Numeria, each digit in 8,645,620 represents a specific value that helps create this unique number. Each place value tells us how many ones, tens, thousands, ten thousands, and so on there are in a number. Remember that as we move to the left in the place value chart, the values of the digits are getting bigger and bigger. The six in the hundreds place has a value of 600, but what about the six in the hundred thousands place? Six hundred thousands means that six has a value of six hundred thousand. Six hundred thousand stars is way more than six hundred. So anytime you might be wondering, what does that number mean? Remember to pay attention to the place value of each digit. Let's check out the number of floating islands and butterfly species on Numeria. Pause the video here to practice identifying the value of more digits in your guided notes. The digit 3 in the number of floating islands represents 300, and we know that because it's in the hundreds place. When checking the number of alien butterfly species, the digit 3 is in the hundred thousands place, so it has a value of 300,000. And the digit 5 has a value of 50,000 in both the floating islands and the number of butterfly species. Their values are equal to each other. So, what have we learned today, besides the fact that Numeria is filled with millions of incredible features just waiting to be explored? Well, now you know that numbers just keep getting bigger, reaching the millions place and beyond. You've learned that numbers follow patterns in their place value names, like the 10,000s and 100,000s places. You know that each digit's value depends on its place in the number. And now you know how to read larger numbers, because commas show where the thousands and millions begin. Be sure to complete the practice questions and extension activities that go with this lesson to practice working with place value to the millions. And remember, mathematicians, in math, as in life, every effort adds to your success. See you next time! Hey.